Long a haven for small government ideologues, Port Clovis prides itself in its lax amusement park safety standards. Only someone had done their sixth grade reading assignment, perhaps this tragedy could have been avoided. Most American cities, the founders of Port Clovis were Freemasons, and probably Illuminati, who congregated in secret UFO bases to perform Luciferian blood rituals. finning enterprise, Mama Maybell Bryant has collected quite a fleet of recreational boats. Her fail sons, Randall and Tyson, can often be spotted piloting them around Sapphire Bay. Sapphire Bay's local hammerhead healthy and strange looking.
on the water for shark hunters? The terminal processor. They're both great with bench lines and effigies. Take out to the cops, and it wasn't nothing but an itty bitty boy. The fact that he was afraid of that Ferris wheel would have told me he wasn't ever going to beat me with the car. With little fanfare, another bounty hunt comes to a close. The parrotfish's two front fused to form beak-like blades prove an insufficient defense against the hungry predator. to take down alpha predators is a skill many shark hunters hone while in prison. Sophisticated wildlife management has never been a priority in Port Clovis, and so amateur hour begins. The corn-fed colossus, Butcher Boy Brady. No more shark attacks on my watch. Let's go. shark relations. This latest cycle of attacks will certainly be among the most infamous chapters in the long troubled history of human shark relations.
well known, volleyballs make way better friends than soccer balls, who will stab you in the back the first chance they get. campaign of extermination. The toast of the coast, Lieutenant Shannon Sims. Let's shoot a shark. situation has escalated, and the price on the shark's head is missing. Despite Port Clovis's best efforts, the aquatic beast refuses to be taken.
evolutionary anomaly, the Hammerhead. entire body. The bull shark triumphs, overcoming her opponent's clearly superior depth perception. As twilight falls, Pete is in an uncharacteristically quiet mood. This is a dangerous job. It's not something unknown to me. Well, you want to see dangerous? Look at that, yeah? That's PT-522. My daddy crewed that off of Guadalcanal. It was Navy. Gunner's mate. Pacific Theater. But when I was 16 men, came back a day later with three. Man survives all that. Was to die here in the Gulf. What happened to him? Boy, you don't like me saying this. But my daddy, his granddaddy, was killed by a mega shark. I, I, I'm sorry. He's talking about a prehistoric fish that went extinct 2.6 million years ago. I seen it. Now, you were a kid. Ain't they discover new animals all the time? Sort of. Well, not, not exactly. In lots of cases, they're just corrections of species with different names. Also stuff like misspelling. But I just say it. Maybe there are things in the water that ain't in your textbook. Stick around. Maybe you learn a thing or two this summer. Whatever.
The ocean is vast. The majority of it still remains unmapped and unexplored by mankind. Perhaps Kyle shouldn't be so quick to dismiss his father's fevered ramblings. Ready, boy. Now we playing with power. I see something. That's Marine Way to look. Let's see you back today. Don't fly, what's inevitable? Say, Saku, young. Hey, you stop that this right now, second. Scaly Pete remains resolute. Where's she at? I don't know. Ah! Big enough to toss her now, ain't you? Come! Get that can! 
Ryan! Dennis! Pique et toi! What remains of the boat lurches, then slowly sinks to the bottom of the sea. And thus begins a new battle against systemic age discrimination. Fenced off for the sole enjoyment of the ultra-rich, mega-rich, and super-rich. This trimaran, like many before it, was lost in its journey to the mythological dry land. When it was discovered that their Stonehenge replica was astronomically misaligned, Enraged Port Clovians threw it in the ocean. While they appreciate human sacrifices, the eldritch gods of yore are seldom enthused about being summoned to Port Clovis. In the not so distant future, a young visionary entrepreneur will spot these three shells while snorkeling and revolutionize after toilet. A quiet space is the ideal stage for the shark to meditate and harness her pure potentiality. 